Hey guys, it's Brandon Miniman from PocketNow.com, and in this video, we're going to talk about how you update third-party apps in Windows Phone 7 and compare that process with Android and the iPhone. So let's get to it. Okay, let's first start off talking about Android, how you update applications. In Android, you actually get a pull-down notification uh, that will tell you how many updates you have available. Right now, there is no notification because I've just acted on one. Tapping on the notification will link you right to the Android market here, where you can see a list of your installed applications and whether any of them have an update. So Launcher Pro up here has an update. So I can update all of my applications at one time if there's more than one that has an update or do it selectively but it works through the notification shade. That's basically how you know there are updates available. The iPhone's a little bit different, and it actually works much like it does in Windows Phone 7. So we have the App Store notification up here that says two, implying that there are two updates available. Tapping on the icon will bring us right to the Updates tab of the App Store, and it'll show us how many updates are available. Trouble with this is that once in a while, the number will be lower than the actual amount of updates. It doesn't update that often. For example, you may have a two, but there's actually four applications that need to be updated. Anyhow, from here, you can update all of the apps, or you can selectively do so uh, by tapping on them individually and installing the apps. Now, in Windows Phone 7, as mentioned, it's very much like the iPhone. So if we unlock the screen here, the live tile shows you that you have one update or two updates, depending on how many there are. And if you tap on the marketplace icon, down here in the bottom left corner, it says one update. Tapping on that will bring you into the app update screen. And from here, like on the iPhone, you can update all with one click, or you can tap on individual apps. Unfortunately, you don't get a change log and update apps individually from here. So a simple and straightforward way to update apps in Windows Phone 7, which is nice, because they're really trying to woo developers to have lots of third-party apps that will hopefully be updated on a regular basis. If you like this video, please give a thumbs up and thanks for watching. That's it for now.